The number of confirmed COVID-19 cases continues to increase in Midland County as they added three more cases, bringing their total to 79. Two of those are residents from the Midland Medical Lodge. Andrews also added one new case. Dawson County added three more cases and Brewster County announced their first confirmed case. All other counties have stayed the same. Dr. Sudi Bose has been on the front lines of some of the uh, of some sort of battle almost his entire adult life from the Iraqi war after 9-11 to Medical Center Hospital's emergency room after the Labor Day weekend mass shooting to fighting coronavirus in that same ER today. Our news director Scott Pickey caught up with Dr. Bose at the Ector County drive through testing site, which he helped launch this week. You have to fight with the army you have and not the army you want. Using military analogies comes naturally to Dr. Sadiq Bose, especially when you talk to him about his career in medicine. He spent the last two months fighting hand-to-hand -hand combat with COVID-19, and it's not lost on him that living through one of the biggest pandemics in American history has turned him into a soldier again and a member of a much bigger team. I mean, it's similar to in the battlefield, those guys you went to battle with, they you know, they're tight and, you know, guys from Odessa Fire Rescue, uh, the nurses, the techs, the staff at Medical Center Hospital, uh, other community leaders. I think, you know, times of crisis bring people together and it's often a bonding experience. And I think when we do look back in history, this is, it's devastating, it's horrible, it's a pandemic. But we will look back and we'll find some positives in this and hopefully move forward and make it a better world. Dr. Bo says this tragedy, like many others, has brought out the best in both the people he works with at MCH and in the community. I've been especially touched by the support that we've been receiving as healthcare workers, whether it's someone sewing a mask and uh, doing that for us, whether it's someone providing food, whether it's someone just providing that support. And I think that is the America that got us from, you know, the Continental Army through two world wars to this war we're fighting today. And I think that human spirit, that American spirit, we have to keep it going. We, we can't lose it in this generation. That was CBS 7 Scott Piggy reporting. Uh, Dr. Bose, by the way, also hopes the pandemic eventually changes how medicine works, making the cost of medical treatment more accessible and affordable.